and welcome back to the Kenobi Minute. Uh, our final story this evening concerns the future. Um, in uh, episode 5, Yoda gives Luke a lot of grief about always being focused on the future and never being focused in the moment. Um, and that's part of Luke's arc, is that he, you know, connects more with the world immediately around him as opposed to uh, thinking about what could be or what could happen. But what I think is really interesting is that Obi-Wan in this one learns almost the opposite lesson. Um, because for most of the show, he's been dwelling on the past, on what has happened, and thinking about the present, about trying to like deal with each problem as it occurs. Um, and his big moment of growth that I think is one of the things that, you know, eventually allows him to begin his journey of reconnecting fully with the Force and becoming a Force ghost is thinking about the future, but not just about the bad things that could happen, but also about the good things that need to be protected. Um, and that is what gives him the, the little piece of strength that he needs uh, to carry on and become Alec Guinness. And I don't know, I just thought that was really beautiful. Thank you for watching my show, and um, I'll see you soon. Thank you.